You're rolling. Okay, so um, here we have the Scrum Alliance, a awesomely big group with very low barriers around the outside, standing on a transparent base. So it is open to the world and transparent. It is moving forward as represented by the wheels. Um, it has um, leadership. The, the community looks to it as a source of ideas, not the single source of ideas by any means, but a source of ideas is represented by this tower. And topping this tower is an antenna, which reminds us it's also incredibly important to be listening to ideas from anywhere in the world, whatever these ideas might be. Um, looking forward from the Scrum Alliance, we have a bridge. One bridge that's already been built, and other bridges that are in progress, that are being built to the other communities. Um, uh, possibly, for example, but not exclusively, perhaps PMI, perhaps the Kanban community, perhaps other communities. Um, we've taken some of their ideas and we've welcomed some of these other community members into our own, represented by these colored bricks that are the same color as the, community, the colors of the other communities. Inside the Scrum Alliance, we have many different paths of progress. Perhaps, for example, at the very bottom, something black representing something maybe foundational for teams. Um, um, you can't see it here, but there's a, uh, an odd-shaped piece um, that rep might represent people who learn something very, in a very different approach than we offer today. And we have people standing on all the different levels demonstrating that they're always striving to learn more and that there are many stepping places along the way. Um, um, at the back, um, we've represented the idea that there are many people helping push the Scrum Alliance forward and helping us to grow um, in whatever forward direction we think we're going. And there's somebody facing out from the Scrum Alliance working with them and other outsiders um, to ensure that we're actually serving their needs as well as them helping the Scrum Alliance. And finally, um, the skeletons um, represent elements of the past that we are letting go and leaving behind and and I'm, oh and um, this person here represent uh, holding tools is a reminder that we have a vast supply of amazingly skilled people who have much knowledge and tools and can help us and can the team remind me of what elements I missed I don't think I missed one no. oh, God.